Welcome to 29th of December's Goli Blessing. Now, how do we become powerful? The only method is to gain the divine knowledge and also to serve others with the same knowledge. You know, there's a saying that if you actually give out money, it increases, right? But what kind of dhan or what kind of wealth or what kind of money are we talking about? So God over here says that it is very important that you give out the right wealth and that is the spiritual divine knowledge and when you serve other people with this divine knowledge automatically the doors to your intellect open up your sixth sense becomes sharper you become more wiser you become more independent and you become more connected to the supreme creator how about this how would you feel when you are connected to the supreme creator by doing the spiritual service how about getting his blessings on a daily basis and that's what we are here to talk about so god says over here in today's blessing may you become powerful and conqueror of maya now maya is the five vices lust anger greed ego attachment jealousy and many more things on the basis of having remembrance and doing service in brahman life now one is remembrance that means you remember the supreme creator you are in connection with the supreme creator and you are doing his service that means you're serving the world on the basis of his guidance and direction imagine that God then says the basis of your brahmin life brahmin life means somebody who knows the supreme creator who understands this creation who understands the complete cycle of the world who understands what's going to happen next as per god the guidance so god says the basis of your brahmin life is having a remembrance and doing service remembering god and serving other people that's it but yes there are other subjects also which is taking knowledge and imbibing that knowledge in terms of changing your character but these two things is what god is focusing about he's saying remember me and serve other people so if the basis of your remembrance and service is weak then your brahmin life sometimes will sometimes be fast and sometimes slow if you have cooperation if you have company if there are the right circumstances you will then continue otherwise you become slack that means we become dependent on other people dependent upon situations so if somebody is giving us cooperation if someone is giving us the company let's do it together let's serve together if there are the right circumstances that means people are there to support you and the circumstances everything is working even the five elements are supporting you even the gadgets are supporting you even electricity is supporting you even the internet is supporting you and many other things which are there to support you to do any kind of service then god says you will then continue otherwise you become slack this is why there has to be this is why there has to be a fast speed in both your remembrance and the service you do so that fast speed can only come when we are not actually pulled down or pulled back by any of these dependencies whether a company whether a good circumstance whether things so all those things should not come in between us not even a cooperation from somebody somebody doesn't cooperate if somebody is not available and we say okay let's not do it then no god says go ahead then this is this is why there has to be a fast speed in both your remembrance and the service you do when there is remembrance and altruistic service when there is remembrance that means you remember god and altruistic service that means you don't need anything for serving you don't want anything in return for serving other people imagine that think about this it is then very easy to become a conqueror of maya and you would be able to see victory in every action as simple as that so if you want to overcome weaknesses the best method is to help others to overcome weaknesses and yourself not become any weak weakness in your own life that means all the cooperation anybody helping you or somebody giving you any kind of help or cooperation or somebody saying let's go and do it together giving you company and if it doesn't come then you are stopped on the way that shouldn't happen otherwise that becomes one of the reasons for lack of zeal and enthusiasm and when the lack of zeal and enthusiasm is there automatically negative energies start attacking us and that's why god says go ahead learn the divine knowledge go ahead remember me and at the same time go ahead do service 
without any conditions and it should be altruistic more about this when you join the prema kumari's 7 day 1 hour a day session and learn about the divine wisdom and how to earn blessings by serving other people with this om shanti